Jimmy Jim Jims, how are you? Well, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot. I've got a bit of good news. I'm having a lot of fun with this week's readings so far. Aries is cracking me up because the uh, angels and guides are in a good mood today. They can make me laugh. <laughs> and it makes the readings even more enjoyable. Okay, well, this is the reading for the 20th to the 26th of July and uh, 2020 and please check whether you are still subscribed on your favorite channels and um, uh, as YouTube is deleting memberships and I hope uh, you will uh, stay subscribed on my channel but have a look uh, any other uh, creators that you follow that you're still subbed okay and thank you very much for your likes and shares and let's get down to the reading and I will be going out um, on Monday Friday uh, Monday Wednesday and Friday for free cards and uh, questions that are supported by donations super chat or super sticker you know the routine if you are a cyber angel and if you're new welcome please subscribe and hit the bell on all and then you'll be uh, notified uh, by YouTube or by me on Facebook, Instagram or um, uh, in the community tab in YouTube when I go live. So make sure that you hit that bell on all. Okay my darlings and I'm pre-recording these readings as I have to go to hospital and um, uh, there's also one video out there um, for you. Um, for each day of the week this coming week and um, so I am know that you um, are supported with the readings you can come back each day and see what the card is of the day or you can load it down the video or you can just um, watch it once okay many choices I hope you have a good week though and I will be going out Monday and Wednesday this week I don't know about Friday because I do have to come back uh, from a long journey. Okay, enough of that. And you know where the information is below the video and in the top right hand corner. Click on that white circle. The first card we have for Monday is the death card. Okay, the death card means transformation, not a real death. You're leaving an old face behind and you're going into a new face. You are changing from a caterpillar into a butterfly. But you can see the sign here, a little sign, and that is a Scorpio. I'll just hold it up to you. You can just see the Scorpio on that stone there. And so you might even be meeting a Scorpio as the death card represents Scorpio. On Wednesday you have the Five of Pentacles. And look at this. The, well, I'm saying that the angels and guides are here with me and they're making me laugh. And it's a great sense of humor when the readings are positive, you know, and... Uh, they are showing me that they are here. You might feel a left out, but that is because you are transforming. You are growing. You might be outgrowing a group of friends or uh, outgrowing a group of family uh, members. I'm not saying that you lose your family members because the blood is thicker than water and they'll always be there for you. But you might be um, transforming in wisdom or in beauty or popularity and you will most probably change your group of friends or family members that you spend so much time with perhaps you might not have so much time for family and perhaps you um, have chosen a new career and that's taking up all your time so don't worry uh, by feeling left out or out of sorts because the angels and the universe have your back you're going into a beautiful new period you are growing perhaps you are much wiser much more spiritual than family members or friends and you have delved into that gems because you are eager to discover the unknown and to learn and I'm sure you will uh, like I said, you might 
start doing something spiritual or you might have a special hobby and you'll spend more time with the people that do the same hobby or have the same faith as you perhaps you might doing, be you doing yoga and you becoming a vegan uh, so perhaps that is why you're going leaning more towards that lifestyle and you'll make new friends so don't worry and look what you've got that is the message from the angels and the divine don't worry love is around you you will be meeting your soulmate perhaps a new partner if you're not hooked up and this could be your soulmate you are emotionally imbalanced because you've got the two of cups and look at the dragonflies they are sometimes little fish or worms or eggs and they uh, are in a cocoon as well and then they come out and they live for a day wow it is your day on Friday you are the beautiful dragonfly they are mystical and magical that's another form of a uh, butterfly well that's a transformation you are in a big transitional period Wow and at the weekend you've got judgment it is 10 past 10 on the clock cowboy time is over you know all cowboy time is starting in one clock it says half past seven and the other one ten past ten so that could be a significant time for you between half past seven and ten past ten you might be getting news because judgment means new beginning you might be getting news that you've got this job between that time you might get an um, email or a text message or a telephone call asking you to come to a meeting 10 past 10 is coffee time and usually from 10 to 10 past 10 to quarter past 10 so the break time is over the new beginning is starting whoopee or you might have a second chance at something but the word judgment something is judged okay and perhaps uh, if you are in a judicial system you might be getting a, a letter from the postman at 10 o'clock just before his break uh, or the postwoman and it will be good news that, that you can start this new beginning transformation is over that could be on Saturday Sunday we don't have post but only email so that's why you could be getting a phone call about something something that is transforming you or something else that you're doing wow big stuff happening for you two gems and you might be meeting a soulmate you might be uh, have met somebody already and you've discovered that they are your soulmate this could be a lady or a man a soulmate is somebody that thinks the same way as you that can finishes your sentences and they because they think the same way as you um, somebody sharp somebody uh, loving passionate and nurturing and we all need uh, somebody that loves us and nurtures us okay and that grows with us that understands us that is a soulmate also that respects us that trust and that we can trust and they trust us we are so much alike this is also like the lovers card right meeting your soulmate um, so it could be a new lover and you might be spending time between half past eight in the evening to ten past ten at uh, in the next morning so they might be staying as a visitor or you might be um, uh, having a weekend away with somebody your soulmate uh, great stuff it could be somebody that uh, you, the judgment or is also a second chance because usually it's Gabriel and the angel that blows life back into the rising dead now you've got also the flower lily here and lily means good luck is the flower of life okay um, also I think you might be taking the weekend off um, in some way or another um, and getting your own space taking rest with perhaps a friend or your partner 
and for from the uh, mystical shaman deck we've got the spiral number 50 uh, five yeah 50 but which becomes a five so you might be feeling like here you've got two fives now so the angels are telling you they have your back you're not alone again they're saying that okay the spiral what I'm also hearing sometimes the spiral um, goes round and round and it's uh, there's not an ending but there will be an ending because you're in transformation you're going on to a new beginning and also something judgment the truth judged somebody something is being judged and you will um, uh, the truth is coming out that's what I'm uh, hearing and something will become clear to you perhaps your perhaps your life's life's path um, this is a very spiritual week for yourself perhaps finding out where you want to go or what you want to do um, in order to belong with the right crowd that thinks the same way as you that feels the same way so look for signs well you've got one two fives which makes a ten ten is an ending a new beginning and this is also a new beginning balancing yourself as well now the spiral is uh, the essence of the message of the spiral is from galaxies in the sky to dimin diminutive shells at the beach the spiral is found extensively in the natural world its shape in the form of a coil serpent has been used since ancient times as a tool for growth and transformation wow the spiral is a guide for en entering deep into one's conscious and the unknown that's what I was talking about perhaps you might doing yoga or spirituality because the uh, cups are spiritual people you'll find a lot of psychics or uh, alter alternative healers therapists that have a lot of water in their chart because it's also the sign of service to others okay um, is a shape in the form of a coil serpent and has been used since ancient times as a tool for growth and transformation the spiral is a, a guide for entering deep into one's consciousness and unknown so don't be scared of your fears and go into the unknown go within and face your fears and then extending far out into the heavens it is crucial to surrender to this journey until the exhausted paradigm dissolves in the depths of the psyche and its energy is released to give birth to a new reality wow the invitation to renew yourself you must shed old skin you have already done so and if you and you've already done this so do not keep scraping away at the old so let the past go that is what I'm saying let the past go and that's what you are doing you'll be coming from a, a, a caterpillar into a dragonfly or a butterfly so do not scrape keep scraping away at the old but welcome the soft new skin that is starting to grow breaking the habit of working on your faults all the time and let nature take its course know that a new skin feels vulnerable and scary at times trust the medicine of the spiral as it guides your journey to renewal so be open and you find a lot of green a lot of purple and pink so it's spirituality you are also um, developing your spirituality because green is the heart chakra so open your heart chakra and welcome the love the pink and the green is Archangel Haniel and Archangel Shamuel and the blue and the purple that is um, the, the blue is Archangel Michael 
uh, Park Angel Michael is the um, angelic um, angel from the throat chakra that protects us. Okay. What I mean to say is that Archangel it represents the throat chakra, so speak the truth, be true to yourself and others, and also he's the angel that protects us with the shield and his sword, so justice will be done, because <coughs> judgment, okay, justice will be done, so you, the truth will come out. He's the angel of truth that speaks the truth. And the indigo color, that is Raziel, Archangel Raziel. Okay, so there's a lot of angels with you this week, so don't feel out of sorts. So that's Archangel Shamuel, Haniel, Michael, Raziel, and uh, who else? Uh, Sapkil, he is the arch and Metatron, because Archangel Metatron is the white light. Okay, and you've got the white here as well in bits and bobs, and he clears our chakras. Just see the spiral as your chakras. There's a lot of colours. I can't see a little bit of yellow here, but there's more yellow here. Okay, and it's funny that this card is just lying above it. Okay. So the angels are here to protect you. So take care, Gemini. Please make sure that you're subscribed to your favorite channels and to this ch channel. And please hit the bell on all. And thank you for sharing and liking. And have a wonderful week. Take care and be blessed. Oh, the angel said, look for a sign. I nearly forgot that. I nearly forgot that. Look for a sign. Well, you've got the sign. Okay, two fives. Ciao, ciao. Sorry. Thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And remember, have a wonderful day and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell on all. And I'll see you in the life. Monday, Wednesday or Friday. Ciao, ciao.